wildcard searches. It's a hectic day in the office, and the principal just asked you to locate a student, Joe Janiszewski. You have a name, and you don't have time to figure it out, but you do know that it ends in S-K-I. The good news is, you can still search for Joe without knowing how to spell his last name if you know how to use this helpful tool, the wildcard. In PowerSchool, the at sign represents the wildcard. The wildcard makes it possible to find records when you only have part of the search criteria. The placement of the wildcard in the text of the search is important because it tells PowerSchool where to fill in the blanks. Let's use the wildcard to find Joe. On the Start page, in the Search Students field, enter the field name, last underscore name. Next, enter equals, and then the wildcard. To get the at sign, press Shift and the number 2. Then type the last three letters of Joe's last name, S-K-I, and click the search icon. The student selection page shows that four students in your school have last names that end in S-K-I, including Joe Janiszewski. Click on Joe's name to open his student record. Use wildcards in the beginning, middle, or end of a search argument. They can even be used more than once in a search. For example, Hannah Chambers' mother just called to notify you that she will be picking Hannah up from school for a doctor's appointment. You need to locate Hannah, but when you enter the search command last underscore name equals chamber, you get a message that says, no students match your entry. Now what? It might be that Hannah has a hyphenated last name, so try this. First enter last underscore name, followed by an equal sign. Then enter at chamber at, placing a wildcard before and after her last name. That way, any name that comes before or after chamber will be included in the search results. And here she is. Hannah's last name is Johnson Chamber, so the search was successful. Since the wildcard was placed at the front and back of the search argument, you also would have found her if her name was hyphenated as Chamber Johnson. Now you can send an office aide to retrieve Hannah from class so she'll be ready for her doctor's appointment. When you have some information, but not enough information, use the wildcard in your search. Insert the wildcard where you have a gap in information and use more than one if you need to. So when in doubt, remember to use the wildcard. It's the tool that won't leave you hanging.